Hello and welcome to the Google My Business Lab as part of our 360 series here at Social School. My name is Kelly Duty and I'm the founder of Social School and I cannot wait to take you through this course. Google My Business is one of those extremely underutilized tools today in digital marketing. And anyone who's got a business anywhere needs to understand how they can optimize their search results and go about showing up in a much better position in search simply by taking ownership of and leveraging the features within the GMB platform to the best of their ability. I love this platform so much because unlike Instagram or LinkedIn or some of our other social platforms or digital tools, Google My Business is honestly like a recipe. You don't have to have this crazy content calendar and content themes and pillars and categories and scheduling and boosted content and ad campaigns. You simply decide uh, what you wanna put in your meal. Are you serving turkey or chicken and what kind of turkey? And then you follow the steps to create this beautiful little uh, you know, information on the internet, this profile that is going to live with you and help you show up and search for people looking for exactly what it is you have to offer. So we're gonna go through some of the underutilized features, which are no-brainer setup 101 pieces of GMB, and then we're gonna get deeper into some of the other elements that can really take it to the next level for you. Why is this so important? Well, I'm glad you asked. We'll address that often. But bottom line, showing up in search, and in particular, local search, so the people in your area, the people traveling to your area who are searching for you in either good old Google search platform or Google Maps or elsewhere on the internet, um, they are going to be able to find you a whole lot better if you've simply set up and optimized your Google My Business page to the best of your ability. Okay, let's dive in and uh, look a little deeper at who this course is for. So anyone who wants to have a better presence online needs to start with GMB. We can look all day long at our deeper SEO factors and the elements in the back end of our website that help us show up in general to the entire world on the internet and show up in top of search where we can. But GMB is again really powerful when it comes to those in our area. So if you want to, to improve those results and thus your leads and your conversions and ideally your revenue and your business success, this is the place to be. We're gonna learn about the foundations of the platform. So where has it come and where is it headed? What features are built in and then what ones can we actually kind of leverage on the side um, with third party tools and some content that we can add to it? What are the biggest rank ranking factors to consider and how can we manipulate or optimize those quite easily? And then what are the other optimization elements that we need to chip away at? And uh, how do we maximize everything within this beautiful platform? to make sure that we're showing up as well as we can. Um, reviews and citations are where we're going to get a little bit deeper. We're all familiar with what Google reviews are, but very few of us are actually using them properly, um, going out of our way to get them and to encourage our users or our friends to start to give them to us along with imagery that they can submit at the same time. And then the way that we respond to people, which is so heavily watched, and it's very scalable. You have one positive review that you respond to as a, as a very human, transparent, authentic business owner or uh, employee, and suddenly you're capturing hearts and minds in a very scalable way without having to have phone calls and handshakes. So reviews go a lot further than we think, and they are so important going forward in this era of distrust and uh, a, a friend needing to tell us what to buy or who to engage with uh, versus the business themselves. And then of course the Google ad piece. So we can create some basic ad campaigns right from our GMB platform, which is pretty cool. And that can be a really great starting point for those of us who haven't been on the internet forever and don't have a whole lot of search history or other ranking factors at play for us. A Google ad campaign can be set up quite affordably to get us started with some paid search results as our organic search results start to grow over time. We're uh, really excited to be taking you through this course. Social School has been around for more than a decade and uh, my first career as a journalist, or maybe it wasn't my first, but back in the day, I really saw the need for businesses to better be able to tell their stories and to not have to rely on media or you know editorial coverage and PR campaigns and agencies in order to do so. And at the 
birth of these social media tools, it was a really fantastic time to shift towards, first of all, running a, an agency or two in content and PR, and then starting to train people how to do it themselves. So if I can use these tools, anyone can, I constantly say, and the best person to be telling your story and optimizing the pieces of your business that are visible on the internet is you and your people because you know yourself so well. We have uh, several, um, well, we have a campus in Calgary as well as uh, several staff across the country and uh, many contractors that we work with. In 2019, Social School ran 19 conferences across Canada. Uh, 2020 was a little different, um, but we are uh, shifting and evolving just like you into whatever makes the most sense. And um, we're very excited to be able to pivot as fast as we can for, you know, to overuse that word heavily. <laughs> um, um, to be able to adapt and, and develop the kind of content that people need right away as these platforms continuously shift and evolve. Our mission at the end of the day, however, is to simply empower you with the tools and the skills that you need to best tell your story online, capture hearts and minds, build trust, and of course, grow your business. So I'm very excited to work with you through this Google My Business Lab and to see you in module number one. Before I meet you there, I just want to bring your attention to the workbook. So within this lab, of course, and from your Social School Academy dashboard, you can download the workbook PDF. You can print it out and scribble in it if you like, or just use it as a digital reference. And essentially, we're going to be referring to it throughout the course. So there's a number of uh, pages and prompts and questions for you that are going to encourage you to really think about how well your page is appearing to others in the eyes of a stranger. We're going to be fleshing out some of the very important pieces of the Google My Business platform using this workbook and this um, the action items within it and hopefully this will be the thing that helps you really hit home and leave with some improvements and some activation of this platform.